Welcome back everyone to Photography by Harrison. Earlier today a storm went through and then I scheduled to go through and my grass is still high. So that means my breakout the Olympus TG6, we're going to get down in the grass and we'll look for some more raindrops. With that being said, I'll see you on the other side of this raindrop hunt. I did getting down the grass and chasing the raindrops. If nothing else, at least it causes you to forget about this 95 degree heat and this high humidity, especially we have here in North Carolina. And if you do like what you see, or, you, or if you don't like what you see, leave a comment below. Why? Because if you like what you see, that motivates me to go out and do more videos so you'll like them next time. And if you don't like what you see, tell me why, because that will also motivate me to go out and do more videos so you like them next time. Because you know when it comes to photography, no one knows it all. And of course, the more you learn about photography, the more you learn you didn't know. Oh, I almost got a, a tip or two. When you are chasing a little raindrop, if the ground's wet, make sure you have some plastic or something to lay on so you, so you don't get that wet. And if it's a little dry, you still want something to lay on. Because remember, while you're chasing the rain, raindrops, you got ants, especially in North Carolina, you get the ants, the grasshoppers, the crickets, all that in the grass. And why they might not hurt you, you might not want them to take them back in the house because you can always shake this out a lot easier than your clothes. And with that being said, as always, I want to thank you for coming along with me on my photographic journey, and I will see you next time.